A logo is displayed, depicting six blind cane-holding figures, arranged in a pinwheel pattern in the colors of orange, blue, and green. They sit atop the words, National Federation of the Blind of Nebraska. Live the life you want. Happy 50th anniversary to our Nebraska affiliate. This is Nancy Oltman, and I have been privileged to be a member of this affiliate for most of those 50 years. The NFB has given me much, much more than I ever will be able to repay by work or contribution. However, I do plan on being around for many, many more years and to continue my contribution. If I have words of encouragement to everyone that is part of this celebration, it would be that you should believe in who you are and to accept the challenges of life with gusto and of course live the life you want. I moved to Lincoln, Nebraska on August 2nd of 1987. One of my first introductions to the affiliate was a picnic at Barbara and Jim Walker's house. I admired their beautiful house, their beautiful yard, and enjoyed the wonderful people. It's a great memory. This is Ryan Strunk, and while I have a lot of memories of my time in the NFB of Nebraska, I think one of the ones that stands out to me the most is Blind People's Court and Changing TV's Channel, the two skits that NABS put on, because they were amazing and hilarious and still incredibly quotable. It was one of those things where the NFB moved for me from something that was an abstract concept into this place where I really could see that people got stuff done but they also had a lot of fun doing it. Mommy, I spilled my Coke. Hello, it's Pat Mauer. I just wanted to say how much I love the NFB. I love it because the organization has given me friendship, it has given me support, it has given me encouragement, and the friendships have meant lifetime friendship, and I appreciate all of you so much, and I wish you a fantastic convention. Without the National Federation of the Blind, I wouldn't have had the opportunity to help blind children get books to read, and I wouldn't have been able to travel to South Africa and uh, Australia and England, and I wouldn't have met Patricia Maurer, and I wouldn't have had the joy of having two wonderful children, and I, so many things would not have happened. I wouldn't be a lawyer today, and because of all of that, and because we have helped to change the nature of what blind people can do in this nation, and what freedom means, it has been a joy. The preceding presentation was brought to you by the National Federation of the Blind of Nebraska. Live the life you want.